up everybody it's Titan C Jack and I'm back at you again with another video today we're going to take a look at a sneaker it's a blast from the past and there's a lot of hype building behind the sneaker it actually has a day dedicated just for the sneaker and a couple of others under this umbrella but before we get into the sneaker I need a couple things from you guys I'm going to need you to hit that like button on today's video also hit that notification bell sub up to the channel if you haven't already now today uh we all know that mama day is coming you probably have read the uh title of the video but mama day is april the 13th which is gonna be a saturday uh that is the anniversary from kobe's last nba game he scored like 60 points or 60 plus points in that game and uh to commemorate that uh, special day, Nike is actually going to have Mamba Day, and there are three pairs of Kobe sneakers are going to retro all on the same day. I already gave you a review on the Philly pair. You can go check that out after this video. Yep. Here they are right here, the Philly pair. You can go check that video out at the uh, conclusion of this video. And there are two more pairs now the pair i'm about to look at well let me see this the philly pair is the least produced pair from uh reports this is the least produced pair and the pair we're going to look at now the hype is building for this particular pair i believe this one is going to be the more popular pair of the three and is the second most produced pair we're going to go ahead and grab the box. All three of these Kobe sneakers from Mamba Day are going to come in this black box. Mamba logo on top. Kobe signature underneath. And this will be under the box. And you have an all over black box with that snake skin scaly detail on the box. And there's a look at the box tag right there. Gonna read it for you guys. It says Kobe 6 Pro Tro. And the color is black, crimson, bog green, and khaki. This is a size 15 personal pair. And these will retail at 190 US dollars. As I open the fold over box lid all over of uh, black inside, white paper, smooth on this side, a little rough on the other, nothing else in the box. Now this sneaker, uh, if you haven't figured it out yet, let me get this back in here. All right, you haven't figured it out yet. We we're talking about the Kobe 6 Italian Camel. The hype is really building for this sneaker. Some people saying it's the best of the pair. Me personally, I love this one, but I think my favorite, I haven't added to the collection yet, or I haven't brought you the video yet at the time recording this one, and that is the Venice Beach. However, I'm definitely rocking with these. I really like all three. Uh, in a later video, I'll let you guys know which one are uh, my favorite from one, two, and three. I'm going to rank them, but uh, these are the Italian camels. Now, this pays tribute to Kobe's childhood when he grew up in Italy. He lived part of his life in Italy when his dad, Jelly Bean Bryant, played basketball in an Italian league. And... I believe Kobe did speak Italian. He uh, was very fluent in it. And uh, he really enjoyed his stay over there in Italy. And, and it, uh, you can see how it affected his life in a positive way. And he came out with these sneakers, uh, the Italian camo, which portrays with the Italian military war during their uh, fighting days. I'm not sure if they still wear these same pattern of uh, camo uniforms, but uh, that's where the uh, Italian camo came from. 
Now, a lot of you guys going to be familiar with the Kobe 6 silhouette. This is the same silhouette that the uh, Grinches are on. So you do have that uh, snakeskin scaly all over. The fit on these are going to be the same as if you are wearing the Grinches. You can see those right there. Uh, I sized up in these because I'm normally a size 14, but in Kobe's, I have to get a size 50. There are no 14 and a half in Kobe, so I had to get a size 15. Now, uh, you make sure you enter all your raffles to get these, because it's going to be a dog fight to get these in, uh, in any manner. Uh, don't depend on the sneakers app. I'm pretty sure I'm hearing that they're going to do a sneaker pass, as I show you the outsole of this sneaker. You got that green and your mama's logo. And you got that carbon fiber there, but uh, make sure you enter all your raffles, your Kobe signature on the heel, Nike Zoom technology on the uh, midsole with black, and you got a little tan at the very bottom, and you got uh, something embarked on here. It's a message. I used to know what this stood for, but I forgot. Uh, if I if it comes back to memory, I'm gonna put it on the screen. But uh, this right here is what I'm referring to on the midsole, right by that pinky toe area. Yeah, uh, you got that crimson color swoosh on both sides. Nylon tongue only comes with the black laces. You got your crimson mamba logo on here. It's the back side, almost like a infrared 23 color. Yeah, it says KB, KB on this one and 24 on this one. Try to get you guys to see that. That's what I meant when I say KB 24, and it does say I want to shoot that molds to my foot. So that's what the message is on the uh, inserts. Does come with shoe trees. I'm sorry, with tissue. And uh, let's see, can I get you guys a production date on these? This is a size 15. And the production date, yeah, man, they made it tough. The production date is 10, 18, 23. That's October 18th of 2023 to 12, 14, 2023 to December 14, 2023. So we almost got two months of production with these. And they really put a lot of tissue in my pair. I got two different uh, sets of tissue in here. But uh, yeah, they are gonna come out on uh, April 13, which is Mama Day on the sneakers app. They're gonna come out an hour later than the normal release is. They're gonna come out on the sneakers app an hour after the sale Jordan 5's come out but uh let me know what pair is your favorite pair let me know how you do in the raffle because I lost on the hybrid raffle so you know how that go I'm gonna go ahead and end the video off with the Nike Kobe 6 Pro Tro the Italian Camo and like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feed Jack, signing out.